first we need to log in click open whatsapp scan the qr code after login you can close or minimize this window make sure this button is ready and green now we need to enter the contact numbers we can import from file we can import manually we can also import the groups and the whatsapp contacts by clicking over here all list come over here we can check we can delete whom we want to send we can clear it uh, similar way we can import the groups we can add the country code if it is not already added in the contact numbers now we will enter the contact manually here we have numbers in the excel just copy and come to the software paste over here you can delete any number manually simply select and delete you can use remove duplication option if you want to remove any duplicate we have same number so i will enable disable this option right now to import otherwise i will get only one number so i'll disable and now i can see the numbers i can add the country code over here right now now we can type the message we can copy paste from another source now it is time to click on the send now button always select the blind mode and now click on the ok button it will start sending the messages so here you can see the messages now campaign is over we got the message click ok and close this window now we will use the filter option for checking or verification the numbers click on the file menu and click on the browse go to your file and select it is on desktop i will select the file and now click on the ok button and all contact comes automatically select the first option if you have used first row as a header and now we can match the fields now insert the country code click ok and now click on the start checking and now we can see the number is available on the whatsapp now we can import directly all verified numbers first i will clear the previous list and now again i will do the same and now i will import all the whatsapp numbers so we can import the regular or the business numbers and now close it now we will check another number i will enter intentionally wrong number import now if i click on the checking button you can see we got the red that message this number is not available on the whatsapp so we can also generate the numbers enter any number over here and you can enter any count like i want to generate the 50 numbers so next 50 number will be available insert the country code click ok and we can verify and now we can export the green or the numbers which is available on the whatsapp for future references now we will use the button option so these are the options first one is the call now button there are three options so first we will use the call now here we will type the text on which we want to uh, display on the button here enter any number you want to get reply or dialed by the user automatically here you need to enter the url so go to your website and copy complete url including the http it will not generate automatically so in this option type the text you want to display on the button enter url and third one is also option for the quick replies don't forget to enable this option and then click on the send now button select the blind mode only and it will start sending the messages so you can pause now i'm going to open my whatsapp so we can see the call now or call us or visit our website option is coming this call now option will work on the own whatsapp mobile app only and you can see the link of our website we can add any type of file like photos i am going to add select the file click open you can set the caption caption is the message you can see the below side of the image you can type any message and you can do the formatting even you can add the buttons below the captions like call now url 
all the button options are available so here i am going to enter a button call now enter the mobile number and you need to enable this option and you need to remove this option click on the send now button blind mode ok and now we can see the caption is coming below of the image call now so whenever the user click on this call now button from the mobile app of the whatsapp now we will use the group grabber function select any group from the left hand side click on the get contacts from the selected groups now you can export for the future references in text file you can import them into the excel or you can add those numbers into the sender list directly by clicking over here now we will learn how we can customize the messages import the data with the customized field here we have two fields in which we have name address and the country code so in the message field first we will type the text you want to send then we will incorporate by clicking on the insert variable number and first we will incorporate the full name then we will add our variable one then variable two and it will select all variables from the row don't forget to enable or disable the add function or add the country code if it we will not add any country code it will ask click on the send button select the blind mode and click ok and now we will see the message with the name and the address in each message will be different based on the row and this is the way we create the customized message you can send the now we will learn about the settings click over here come to the sending settings the this first field we have to enter the number in the seconds we want to make the gap between the two messages in the second field always enter the two this is the second option for friend list this is the option we used for not getting banned 